In a world striving for economic progress, women play a key role. But how do we integrate women's economic empowerment effectively into business environment reform projects? Our latest report, How to Make the Business Environment Work for Women's Economic Empowerment, outlines five essential steps. Step one, before the project. The first step is even before the project has started, setting the scene in early discussions, making the point that women's economic empowerment isn't only about social justice, it's also good for business and it is strategic. Step two, project design. The ICR facility offers tools to support the design of your projects. For example, the gender sensitive business environment reform diagnostic from our toolbox, which was used in Tuvalu to analyze the investment climate. Step three, project implementation. The ICR facilities business environment reform for women's economic empowerment training offers a great start to bring stakeholders together and create common understanding and buy-in for the project. This was done in Nigeria for the project with the Akiti Development and Investment Promotion Agency. This training is also available online and can be taken by yourself. Step four, post-implementation. We organize peer-to-peer -peer exchanges to enable other partners to benefit from the lessons learnt and build networks for change. In Kigali, we hosted a conference for 140 participants from all over the African, Caribbean and Pacific regions to discuss best practices and reforms to empower women as entrepreneurs, employees and leaders in public-private dialogues. Step five, monitoring and evaluation. Monitoring and evaluation is the golden thread to make sure the project remains gender transformative. Women's presence should be built in at every step, from information gathering to information validation. Find out more in the ICA report, Making the Business Environment Work for Women's Economic Empowerment, and the ICR Knowledge Hub at icrfacility.eu. Knowledge Hub. Mm -hmm.